Hi, Steve here. I do get uh, from Steve Sher, McCann Clark. Now, I do get a few people asking me about where I get all my gears from. But I do buy some and I chop some up and I do make quite a few of my own. So here's a little video on how I do it. I'm only an amateur. I've only been machining for three or four years, self-taught. But here's a, I'm going to do a series of video of how I cut my gears, just so people can see how I do it and you can have a go, whatever. The, these are the type of things I do. We've got mostly these are aluminium. There's a plastic one. There's a blank, steel blank, ready to cut. And well, there you can see. Here's one that's most of these are cock ups like that. Look, you can see that. But this type of thing. So I've only got a small mill, and here it is. Got a digital readout on it. So I've got my rotary table set up here, clamped down, and a tailstock clamped down. So this is all in line and then it's all dead straight and test it all so it's all running true all ready for a blank to go on it something like that then I'll machine something like that and then this will bolt onto here then I'll cut the gear so this is part one setting up machine so that's all set up now ready to go this arbor in here I'll just machine that on my lathe to suit blanks with a 10 mil hole um, and then I'll put that on here and I'll bolt that on then I'll cut the gear I've got to set it up put the gear cutters in and everything but I'll do that on another video I'll put the gear cutter in and then I'll show you how I cut the gear and I'll explain to you how the rotary table works so you've got an idea of how you do it for you amateur machinists like me might find it interesting oh you do so that's part one setting the machine up uh, and I'll see you in the next one okay see you in a bit <laughs> 